Hello students, good morning. Uh, in your previous period, we learned about your uh, input devices, uh, that is your electronic card reader, your MICR, joystick, such things we learned in your previous period. Now today we are going to start with your first topic that is your speech and vision device. Now speech and vision device means, as you all know that instead of typing, instead of typing, if that particular typing can be done by using the word by using your speech it is very easy that is the best example I can say that this is a Google speech okay this is a Google website either we if I want to search anything that is your uh, wild wildlife animals in India and after giving an enter you can see the images and whole data will be there instead of this thing if I am using this button that is a search by voice can you see over here this button voice button if in case if I am clicking on this button what happens instead of typing I can use my voice commands okay I'll just see the demo wildlife animals in India Can you, uh, can you see that means you can see as well as we can hear also this is the best example of a speech and voice recognition that means instead of giving or uh, typing the things we can use the voice commands for for our better user experience okay for better experience we can use th this thing of in, instead of thing uh, if I want uh, I want to no today's weather in Surat see the today's weather is about your 32 degrees Celsius if just imagine how much how much time I've taken to write this instead of that if I, I can use this also I want to know today's weather in Sudar. Have you heard it? That means whatever things we are going to type, the same thing we are going to use by using the voice commands. This is the best example of your speech and voice device. Understood? In each and every electronics we are having the and another best example is that we are having in your mobile phone also in your mobile phone also we are having uh, the thing that is your google assistance okay we are having the google assistant by using the google assistant we automatically we can open the apps whichever apps we want okay that is in your android phones in for in your for using in your iphone that is your ios we will be using siri 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 commands and for your uh, laptops according to windows 10 we will be having uh, cortana cortana is the voice command thing this uh, this is the best example of your speech and vision device now next topic is about your output device output device the first thing is about your monitor in your monitor you can see monitor it is the best example of your output device in your previous uh, lecture that your previous uh, last to last week I have given you a lecture during that time I have explained you what do you mean by input device in the in that I have explained that input device is the particular device which allows the user to enter the value that means it takes the value and give to your computer and the best example of your input device is that your uh, keyboard and mouse and other ex extra examples are that your that is your uh, headphone earphone or we can use it as a uh, joystick also that means whatever commands we are giving according to that particular commands it will be working this is the best example of your input device now after taking the input uh, after taking the value uh, it sh it should be shown to some other 
area that means after getting the input we have to give the output for getting an output see now you can see if i'm using my uh, mouse after using my mouse uh, in my mouse right click after clicking on a right click you can see any additional options are there this additional options after clicking on mouse mouse is an input device after clicking on mouse what i am getting i am getting this results in my uh, monitor this result that means this is my final output this final output is known as your output devices okay understood that means if i want to close this tab if uh, for closing this tab i will be using this button for closing it uh, but uh, for closing it i have to use my mouse for closing it if i'm clicking on it see can you see on the top part if i'm clicking on this cross symbol now after clicking on it i am getting the output i can see, uh, see the result in my monitor this is the best example of your output device okay and another uh, that is your output device output is present on computer visual the tv television screen that is your this monitor is the best example of your output devices okay uh, another thing is that next topic uh, point is about that it uses crt that is the full form of crt is that cathode ray tube underline it underline this part and uh, full form that is your cathode ray tube and flat monitors are used to display the information i'm you i'm going to use voice commands types of monitors Can you see types of monitors? In olden times, we were using this monitor, this type of big monitors. Okay. Then after this was your CRT cathode ray tube. Okay, and it was very bulky one. Then after uh, they started using flat monitors. That is which that is your this type of monitors. Uh, this type of flat monitors. Now we are using that is your LCD and LED monitors, which is more uh, power saving monitors and which is uh, more lightweight than your previous one. Okay, in olden times, we were actually many types of monitors were there according to your generations. In olden times, we were using uh, CRT monitors, then after for uh, reducing the size they started using flat monitors now for your better uh, after reducing the size as well as for uh, reducing the power for increasing power saving mode what we are using we are using the lcd and led and the full form of lcd is there is that liquid crystal display uh, and the full form of led is that light emitting diodes underline it these are your technologies which is used in your flat monitors right now so what happens after using this technology uh, it enables to make that particular monitor in a simple and in a light to beat okay the next example of your output device is that your printer now printer is the best example of your output device why that means if i am i want to get this output that means if i want to this particular areas print what i will be doing after clicking on it you can you you see the option print option after clicking on print option I won't be see anything in my monitor what happens the this, this particular page print will be getting from my printer that means I'm giving my input by using mouse th uh, through monitor but where I am getting the output that is in my uh, printer this is the best example of your output devices okay now types of printer types of printer uh, first of all we will be saying dot matrix printers or character printer that means dot matrix printers means examples of your dot matrix printer see this is your best example of your dot matrix printer that means uh, nowadays we are getting the print in a proper way that during that time in olden times we were using dot matrix printer where small small dots will be there it will be writing nowadays still uh, for getting the electricity bill also in some uh, taxes government uses this type of printers 
just for the convenience only they are using this dot matrix printer so what happens in that printer printer they will be there will be small small dots then the, a group of such dots becomes of one alphabet okay this is the best example of your dot matrix printer and right now we are using the uh, oh, sorry we are using the laser printer which is uh, fast as and as a technology laser printer the nor normally examples of your laser printer see these are your printers right now we are using it see this type of printer color printers okay this uh, this is the another best example of your uh, output device which is known as your laser printer this printers we are seeing right uh, today each and everywhere example of inject printer example of inject printer see this are your uh, color printers what happens in this printer but it is very slow uh, slow but what uh, and it will be spraying that particular uh, word that means if uh, this if i'm uh, want this page to be printed so what happens it starts spraying and uh, compared to your laser printer this inject printer is very slow and it is very costly why because it is it mainly uses for your color printer okay this are your best example of your output device today we'll learn two output devices the first one was your monitor and second is your printer in your monitor uh, in olden times we were using crt as well as your flat monitors okay then after today's technology we are using the lcd and led monitors is it clear okay and the full form of crt is cathode ray 2 full form of lcd is your liquid crystal display and full form of led is light emitting diodes now next example of your printer uh, example of your output device is that printers and printers as i told you whatever commands we are going uh, to give in your computer it will be getting or it will be showing that particular output in my printer and the best examples of your printers are your inject printer dot matrix printer laser printer such are your examples of your printers next another best example of your output device is that projector now projector as you all know that but uh, suppose if i want to show uh, uh, a particular topic f uh, if I, I want to show a particular topic uh, to my classroom in my classroom okay to, uh, and as you know that in a classroom around 50 to 60 students will be there so it uh, do you think each and every students will be visible if i'm showing this thing particular topic in my laptop or in a computer no maximum it will be taking uh, 10 students to understand it that means only 10 students can stand here and they can view it just imagine if i want to show more than uh, 50 students it is it is uh, this uh, laptop or uh, monitor is not a proper option instead of that what i will be doing i will be using the projector and as you know that in in each and every classroom we are having projector so what happens the whole content whatever seeing in whatever content we are going to see in this particular uh monitor the whole topic or a whole content will be displayed on a big screen and this big screen is known as your projector okay so it is visible to more than 50 to 100 people for uh, in a for a better view we will be using the projector understood and this is the third example of your output devices now last topic is about your voice response voice response uh, as you all know that voice response uh, stored voice and converted voice can be presented to the user who do not want to see and read output on monitors that means what happens whatever we are going to type okay that particular uh, type uh, thing will be said as an output and the best example i've shown you before i've given you examples of your wildlife animals in India that I will show you wildlife animals in India
हैव यू हर्ड दिस वॉइस दैट मीन्स अगर वॉट आई हैव डन आई हैव जस्ट रिटर्न वाइल्ड लाइफ एनिमल्स इन इंडिया ऑटोमेटिकली द आउटपुट हैज बीन शोन इन माई लैपटॉप एज वेल एज दे आर सेंग थ्रू माई देर पर्टिकुलर वॉइस दिस इज द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ योर वॉइस रेस्पॉन्स दैट मीन्स आई डोंट नीड टू रीड इट इट ऑटोमेटिकली सेज इट एंड आई कैन हियर इट ओके दिस दिस आर योर बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ योर आउटपुट डिवाइस इन दिस वे योर थर्ड चैप्टर भी कंप्लीटेड ओके ना टूडे द लास्ट टॉपिक वॉज योर आउटपुट डिवाइस एंड टूडे वी लर्न दैट इज योर फर्स्ट टॉपिक इज दैट इज योर मॉनिटर सेकेंड प्रिंटर थर्ड टॉपिक इज अबाउट योर प्रोजेक्टर एंड फोर्थ टॉपिक वॉज योर वॉइस रेस्पॉन्स आई होप यू ऑल अंडरस्टैंड टूडेज टॉपिक थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स फ्रॉम योर नेक्स्ट period onwards we will be starting with your fourth chapter okay thank you